switch on the transmitter first it is ambulance so there is no ambulance since the switch is in the off mode no switch on the receiver No traffic and no ambulance. Now enroll the RFID cards. Here we have three cards. We will enroll one card. This card acts like a theft vehicle. And these are the normal vehicles. Press and hold the enrolling switch. Reset. Place card to enroll. Card has been enrolled. Now, enter into normal mode by pressing reset switch. And there is no traffic. Now, count is 4. Again one. Two. Three. Traffic is medium. So every time the account will be cleared. Traffic is cleared. Now again I will enroll one card. So one vehicle entered. Traffic is low. Again. Two. Third vehicle entered. Fourth one entered. So for more than 5 vehicles, it will show high traffic. For single vehicle, low traffic. Uh, in the 2 to 5, it will show medium traffic. So here is a theft vehicle. When theft vehicle is detected, it will send SMS to the enrolled number. We can enroll the mobile number using number switch here. Press the number switch. Press and release the reset button and hold the number switch. It will display waiting for call. Now for call now call to the sim card which we have inserted in the GSM model we get a busy door and dis it displays mobile number on the LCD now restart the system by pressing reset button Now when the 
theft vehicle is detected it will show the vehicle number in the lcd and we will get a sms theft vehicle detected at junction since the, there is no traffic uh, the traffic signals will be changing continuously with a normal delay when the ambulance enters into the junction it displays as ambulance in the lcd and green light signal will be given to the ambulance side here is a gsm uh, we have a uh, two leds for the status indication and the power indication and uh, this uh, led which is blinking is for the network indication wait until you get the network then you will receive the sms